Another very important animal story, though quite a bit smaller. Yes. Today is Groundhog's Day. Yeah, yes. yeah, February 2nd. The country's most famous groundhog, Punxsutawney Phil, gave his prediction. He emerged from his burrow in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania this morning. He apparently did not see his shadow. Uh, they tell us that means we have an early spring. All I think it means is that a yeah. We're gonna animal did see a shadow. <laughs> <laughs> that served as good news, they say, for anyone sick of winter. You hear the crowd of cheers as that came out. We can hear and listen to the crowd's reaction. But what this weather did not provide is a shadow or reason to hide. Glad tidings on this Groundhog Day. An early spring is on the way. That poor animal has to be traumatized. You know, I think it's been a while since he's predicted that with the groundhog. We've had a lot of long winters he's predicted, I think. Right? So, yeah. <laughs> so what we've got on screen right now is UDOT having a bit of a response to the rodent's prediction. Well, we know Utah weather kind of moves on its own watch, uh, isn't necessarily decided by a rodent in Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. um, so they posted this on <laughs> Facebook today. It says, hey, Punxsutawney, we don't know how to tell you this, but Utah makes up its own rules when it comes to the weather. Don't worry, we'll be prepared for another 26 weeks of winter. I don't know what the way this Way to make yeah. us uh, not feel so good about it, UDOT. 26. That, at, at least they're prepared for that, what you get in some places. 26. Yeah. I will say with the Three. way this winter's been going compared to last, I feel like the groundhog might have been right. <laughs> so we'll see that. You know, oh, I, I hope I'm so. just thinking that I might put a little more credence in uh, in Lindsay or Chase or Trent. Their, their thoughts on what's coming a little bit more than whether uh, Punxsutawney Phil sees his shadow or not. Well, we know that today it's been raining and it's a little chilly outside, um, but no snow, at least not here in the valleys. Okay, well, yeah. we took a look at his accuracy. CBS News reports that between 2013 and 2023, he only saw a shadow seven times. Of those, he was only right once. So worse than chance. I think you were yeah, worse, right worse about trusting than the just, meteorologist. Uh, worse then. than chance. <laughs>